Let's begin the solution of the third midterm with the short questions at the very beginning. Compute f of t for this f of s. The exact answer is required. As with the homework assignment, the function must be 0 for t less than 0, which means, of course, that you multiply the final answer by the heavy side step u of t. The first thing I'm going to do, and you guessed that, enter that function into your calculator and find for the inverse Laplace transform. You could do this by hand too, but it wasn't required. And now we type that function of s, but using x in lieu of s, and making sure we do not miss any multiplication operator between any two parentheses or any coefficient and letter x. At the end of that, we'll ensure that all the radio buttons in the mode CAS submenu are cleared. Before we go to the calculus menu and within it to the differential operations submenu, click and in there the inverse Laplace. That is an inverse Laplace transform, a function of t represented by x. But it's too long. Let's break that object into pieces, one at a time. Delete, delete. Swap and break the other sum also into pieces. Delete and delete. And those are the three terms of our solution, a function of time, x in lieu of t. Let's copy that down to the paper. And in the paper copy, make sure that you add the u of t to ensure that this function is 0 for t less than 0. And that is this part of the question. Let's move on.